my own opinions, and I did not copy anyone else's. Also, this video was not meant to insult anyone by their game-building abilities, I am just. Comparing them to the real Bloxburg, so please do not take this seriously. So here we are and here is a quick overview of the game. It looks pretty similar so far. Let's start here. There are some picnic tables, which Bloxburg does not have but I guess that's okay. They have McDonald's on them lol. The ice cream place looks the same, but you can't work here. Let's move on. So the ferry's wheel also looks the same, but you cannot ride it. So here we are at the houses. It doesn't look like we can build, which is a bit weird, but I might be wrong. I was able to get into this house. It looks okay, I guess. Let's move on to the rest of the town. I will speed up this part. They do have a playground, which Bloxburg does not have, but I think it would be cool if Bloxburg added one. Here they have a city hall and a town hall. I like this town hall more because it has more details. So all the buildings are in different places, and it does not look like you can work at all. Here they added a coffee shop, which I think would be a pretty nice addition to Bloxburg. They also added another supermarket. Okay guys, so here we are in the next game. I guess it's okay, but it looks way worse than the last one. Here is a quick overview. Let's start here. They have the same pizza place as the other game. There is a random treadmill. Here I have no idea what it's for lol. They also added the same Ben's ice cream. Over here they put an adoption center. Luxburg does not have this in their game. Let's take a quick look at these houses. They aren't bad. They look kinda like the starter house in Bloxburg. I have no idea why there is so much food in the kitchen. LOL LOL. I think the rest of the houses are the same so let's move on. The Mike's Motors and Bloxburg Gym are also the same. 